Hey, what's going on everyone? NECA here. Hope you all having a wonderful day today so far. I know I am. And today, as you guys can see, we're back on IW4X and we're going to be trickshotting today as always. But actually, today's video is going to be a little bit different because today I'm actually finally bringing you guys a long-awaited video. I know you guys have been asking for this one for a little bit now. And this one is actually months in the making, so I'm sorry that it took so long, but it's finally here, boys. And if you're wondering what I'm talking about, well, you know what? I'm just going to go into my creative class menu real quick and I'm going to show you guys what I'm talking about. I know my face cam is going to cover it up a little bit, but as you guys can see, when I go into my creative class, that's not a camo on mw2 that i have on my intervention and the reason that is is today i'm actually finally bringing you guys the long-awaited cold war custom camo pack as you guys can see these camos are all from black ops cold war but we were able to port them over in mw2 so as you guys can see if i go down the list i think this one's called scavenger then oh i forgot the name of that maniac actually the cadence glitch ah uh, i forget that one wait cosmo not blue tiger Funkadelic and a uh, seducer. So yeah, we got all those camos from Cold War. So yeah, in today's video, I'm gonna be showing off all these camos individually, talking about them, giving them a little showcase, and then actually showing the shots that we ended up hitting with them. And not only am I just gonna be showing off the camos, but in today's video, I'm actually gonna be giving you guys this camo pack for completely free. Because one, I think charging for camos is lame. And two, I've had these camos for months now, so it's time I stopped gatekeeping them and finally let you guys hit some build cams with them as well. If you guys don't know how custom camos and IW4X work, I actually made a tutorial a few months back when I made my first camo pack. I'll be leaving a link to that tutorial in the description below, as well as a download link to this camo pack. So after you watch the tutorial and you know how to actually use these camos in IW4X, you can download this camo pack and get to hitting some trick shots for them. But yeah, without further ado, we're gonna move into the camo showcase now. I do gotta say this is a longer video, so if you guys do enjoy it, please make sure to drop a like rating on the video and a comment in the comment section below. Let me know what your favorite shot or part. Actually, you know what? Today, let me know what your favorite camo is in this video. And yeah, without further ado, let's get into the IW4X custom camo trick shotting action. Hopefully, you guys enjoy the video. All right, boys. So we're going to be starting off with a desert camo, or I should say the replacement for the desert camo, which is like this cheetah looking camo. In Cold War, this camo is called Scavenger, and it's one of the camos you get from doing zombies challenges. I don't think it's in multiplayer at all. And I'm not going to lie. I think this is my least favorite one from the Cold War camo pack, just because it doesn't really look like it belongs on MW2. But regardless of how it looks on the game, you already know your boys still did some bangers with it so here we're gonna get into those clips now my bad for not mentioning you i didn't mention like conflict or missy either i wasn't really thinking my boys i was thinking like underrated people oh there we go haha <laughs> i knew that was gonna hit i i don't know why i just had a feeling but there we go the little knack to can cock shot pretty clean did i get the prone hey i got the prone too let's go yeah we're at 337 now adrian bro yo Asuka called he was gonna hit a banger but yeah, dude, I was at 420 subs, but we lost like 100 or 80 overnight. Oh, did he get the reload knack? Dude, Asuka. And he's using a camo for once. Let's go. Dude, I didn't expect that. Hey, the floral crew neck. Oh my god, I reload knack to the brains right as Cirque hit. But the floral crew neck's one of my favorites, not gonna lie. Oh, Cirque. Damn, he hit the bounce. Of course he did. Oh, where was he? Ooh, I don't even know where he was. Dude, the kill cams are laggy, which I hate about this game mode. Like, <laughs> you've done more than enough tonight. Oh my god. People went crazy. Asuka just hit right in front of me. Dude, he's the king of this oil rig train. He hit a knack to, to far? Dude, what Asuka? He m knacked it. He hit the m knack? I said I was going to watch clips at five hours. Fact, bro. That was fucked, Asuka. I can't miss him. I'm... Ooh. Yo, dude. Oh my, this was fire. Oh yeah, that was dope. I lined it up a little bit, but hey. Ham OGK, haha. <laughs> About time I hit that shit. So yeah, as you guys can see, we had some pretty sick shots with a cheetah camo, or a scavenger I should say. But moving on, we're going on to another Cold War Zombies camo. This one is going to be replacing your Arctic camo in IW4X, and it's called Maniac in Cold War. Like I said, it's another Zombies camo, not multiplayer. And unfortunately, even though this is probably like my favorite camo, or one of them in the pack, I wasn't able to hit any shots with it, but my boys were able to hit some bangers. So we're going to show you guys those shots now. Dope. Oh wait, did someone just hit? Wolfie hit, let's go. Oh, okay. Dude, wait. Oh my god, Wolfie. That was really, really fucking sick, dude. Oh my god, yo. You didn't have to spaz like that, brother, man. You really didn't, Wolfie. Damn. Yeah, dude. Um, Their music... I remember liking it back in the day, but I never like really listened to it. I just watched Brian hit. I watched the bullet connect and everything. Okay, let's see it. Oh my god, did he just win the 2500? Oh, I thought it was going to be a reload, Knack. It's pretty dope. I think soft spot, right? Good shit, good shit. Yeah, soft spot, he did. 
Uh, that shot was fire. You know how that guy, bro, I am that guy. Loving the old logic in the playlist. Yes, sir, dude, we actually did a vote. What should we listen to on stream? It was like old Juice World. Oh, Kane hit? Did he hit from here? No way he hit from up top. No way. He hit to, to spawn? Oh, with the reverse and the soft land with the daily after? What the hell, Kane? Yo, that was a banger. So yeah, as you guys can see, this camo goes pretty crazy on the intervention. Unfortunately, like I said, I wasn't able to hit any shots with it, but I really do like how it looks. So I might go back and use it sometime, maybe try to hit a banger. Keeping up with the theme of zombies camos, we're actually gonna be moving on to the replacement for Woodland. And this one is like an all black camo with like gray flowers on it. I think it's called Decadence. And once again, like I said, it is a zombies camo in Cold War. I didn't mention this before, but you can use all the zombies camos in multiplayer, by the way. It's not like only in zombies. But anyway, yeah, this is what it looks like. And unlike the replacement for Arctic, this the cadence camo was actually like my lucky one i ended up hitting a bunch of shots with it which you guys are about to see right now but yo these lobby spots are getting serious huh people are starting to gamble from oh wait i might have landed i might have landed but i also might have soft spotted all right hold on did i soft spot oh i landed damn what do we do with it boys <laughs> now it's a leftover i know but fuck oh frenzy has hit two in one game no way Oh, oh, he said, oh, it must have been dope, too. Oh, my God, that was actually pretty dope. Is this dude going to put his FPS up to get on the ghetto bird? Oh, for another almost hit. That was so trash, dude. But, yo, the three almost hits this game. You know what that means, boys? That means I have an app. Never mind. I was going to say I have an actual shot coming up this try, but, um, maybe not. I forget the exact math, but. I mean, I could do the math. I'm actually just very lazy and tired. Oh, I hit a little lefty. I didn't get the knack after. Or I didn't get the wazy whip either. I should have been spinning on ground to get the wazy whip. But it was a decent little lefty, I suppose. <laughs> yeah, nothing crazy. My Twitch, that's not even a warning. They catch you. Someone reports me. My stream's gone. Oh, another almost hit, boys. Unfortunate. Well, it, was, it wasn't even me that said it. You guys suggested it. Tweet at them that could do it to them. Oh, I was gonna say I need a shot to tweet out, and I just hit a shot. That's so weird. I was literally gonna say I just need a shot to tweet out, and I'll tweet it out again. But there we go. <laughs> that's that's something. <laughs> like this video in the next 10 seconds, they'll see it. Dude, I'm liking the video. I, I just liked it. <gasps> I got an almost hit. Fuck you. Sorry, I had to rage. Dude, how do you just call that out, bro? That's fucked. I raged. I'm sorry. All in. I'll go all in. I just, I had to do it for the content, boys. Like, that's perfect for a video. <laughs> you literally, I just, I read my intro saying that I'm going to get an almost hit and then got the almost hit. Like, come on. Pick yourself. I should have, dude, I said I liked the video. Honestly, those NECA videos are scam, yo. Oh, no, guys. This is bad. I'd beam you. Yo, wait, um, ooh, let's go. Through the map. Hey, hey. That was good. That was a nice little shot. Little, oh, it's easy scope thing. Hey, hey, little through the map shot. I fuck with that. If I said, hi, Twitter. Why, oh, Twitter, bro? That's a YouTube clip. And now you guys can see why I said I got so lucky with the camo. Like, those shots were a few months ago, don't get me wrong. But at that time, I was just hitting non-stop with this camo. Like, left, right, and center. Oh, wait, I just realized my sub goal is still on the stream from when I was live last night. Here, let me take that off real quick. But, little shout-out. If you guys haven't checked out my Twitch yet, I'm going to be leaving that link in the description below. I do stream IW4X every other night using custom camos from different Call of Duties just like this. So, if you ever want to appear in one of these videos, that's definitely the best way to do so. Actually, that's the only way to do so. So, so if you ever want to make an appearance in one of these videos, like I said, make sure to come by the stream sometime and hit a bill cam in one of the games. But moving on from the replacement for Woodland, we're going over to probably the most cursed camo in this pack. This is the glitch camo, which is, uh, I don't know, this one might be my least favorite over desert, not gonna lie. But the reason this camo is actually so cursed isn't the way it looks, it's just the fact that nobody could hit any shots with it. Like we use these camos for like a month or two and I literally only have one shot to show you guys and it's actually my shot. And the craziest part about the shot is... Actually, you know what? I'm just going to show you the clip, then I'll explain after. So here, let's get into the one shot we have with it now. No, I, I'm not even like... I, I, no, fuck it. I'm not going to end it. I feel bad saying that because I'm not... Oh, I hit. What the hell? I didn't even mean to hit. <laughs> but I was going to say, like, I'm not trying to... Um, fuck, what was I saying? Hold on. Where was this guy I even hit on? Was he just in that little window right there? I have no idea where he was, actually. <laughs> 
Now that's the only thing I hit new is. All right, so what I was gonna say before the clip is the only reason I even had this camo on, it was so cursed, I didn't have it on any of my classes. The only reason I had it was because I was playing Shaking Gun Game, where it gives you a random class like every time you respawn. And those random classes have random camos, and it just so happened to give me this one that I ended up hitting that shot with, but besides that, nothing. This one is actually another Zombies camo. No surprise there, the Zombies camos are like way better than the multiplayer ones in Cold War. But anyways, this one is called Glitch. All right, so moving on from Digital or Glitch, whatever, we're actually going on to the replacement for urban and this one is actually called cosmonaut and it's the first multiplayer camo in this cold war pack i know you guys probably thought you'd never see the day you probably thought this was like a zombies camo exclusive but no we finally got a multiplayer camo and you know what i'm just gonna say it. this one is actually my favorite one in the cold war camo pack it actually looks beautiful on the intervention and actually every sniper which you guys are gonna see now dude let me hit that so steezy let's go back to a shout out let's go dude big fact shout out umzy oh Yo, I didn't get the catwalk after, but that was so steezy, dude. 552. Oh, tell me a show the H flipping kill cam. Oh, it did. Oh, yo, he was deep too. Hey, I was just saying how I want to hit that. Oh, torn hit. Let's go. Dude, I'm more impressed that there was a care package up there. Okay, torn. Oh, no Adalia, but that was still nice. Maybe let you reinstall. I don't think you'll have to reinstall. Oh, no, boys. That was fucking sick. Oh, that was a reload knack to titty knack, yo. Oh, Shade just hit. Okay, okay. Let's see what Shade hit after. And Ellie, huh? Stop and stare, he says. Damn, dude. Shade just went unreal that round. He had, like, got two almost hits and hit a fucking crazy shot from the sky. Dude says lefty might be casually. <laughs> hey, the best for you to redeem the Twitter follow. I got you, bro. Let's hope I hit a bang on this game. Oh, called it out. Hey, that was easy enough, huh? That was cool. Was he on bridge too? Haha. <laughs> I said, I hope I had a bang on this game for real. And 80 viewers now. Says he's trash. That's a shot for real. Was he on bridge or where was he? Wait, did someone hit? Hold on, guys. Sorry. Wait, someone did hit. No way. Brian hit, oh, 550 too? Dude, I'm trying to get my upload premiered and Brian smacked a 550, what the hell? Good shit. I need to turn this music down though, really, really badly, oh my god. Are you gonna pick you with food? Shit, probably. I mean, oh, I hit a fucking banger. I knew I was gonna hit last game of stream, boys. I literally called that out. I finally hit the titty neck. How did I know I was gonna hit that last game of stream? Yes, dude, that was so nice too. Yup, there we go. And now you guys see why I love this camo so much. Not only does it look good on the guns, like with the all white finish with the black lines and like the holes, it looks really nice. Not only that, but the little red touch on top gives it the extra touch. I really like how that looks. But honestly, regardless of how the camos look, I know that these clips are a few months old, but I think I kind of hit some bangers with this camo, not gonna lie. I don't know, with this urban one, I low key feel like it was just like the woodland one where I'd put it on and my no scopes would just connect. Unlike the Arctic one, that one was a no-go. But anyways, enough rambling about this camo. We're actually moving on to Blue Tiger, which in Cold War is literally just Blue Tiger. It has the same exact name. Once again, a zombies camo though. But I don't know. I think I like MW2's Blue Tiger more. This one definitely works on Cold War. It looks tight on MW2, but I'll let you guys be the judge of it with the clips that I'm about to roll right now. I just tweeted out uh, the stream. Oh my god, Smitty hit. I wasn't even at last yet. But, uh, dude. Let's go, dude. He actually called that a UC member was gonna hit. Oh, he hit with the brains? Oh my god. Dude, let's go, Smitty. Hey, I see you. That was far, too. You on pace to end at 7.45 p.m.? Oh no, habits hit on me. He said, what the fuck? What, what happened here, habits? I was up top ladder. Oh, he hit? Damn. Oh, he had a reload knack on me. What the hell? Dude, I actually got slapped, yo. Bill came down. That was like one of the nicest shots tonight. I'm just trying to... Ooh, Zaiku hit. I'm just trying to think of things to like fill up the rest of the stream, you know? Oh, let's go. Let's go, Beast. Oh, cool little wall bang. That's pretty cool. I like it. A wall bang this game? That's a pretty easy one to predict. I think someone will definitely hit a wall bang this game. Not counting the one Zaiku already hit. Because Zaiku already hit. I'm talking about the rest of the game. He hit a two-piece. Wait, Zaiku just hit two shots one game, and this one's a two-piece. No way. Okay, was it a wall bang? Uh, 
Oh, it was a wall bang. I'm gonna end the prediction. I'm gonna end the prediction. Yeah, as you guys can see, this was another one of my unlucky camos. I really did want to hit a shot with it before I put this video out. Same with the Arctic one, but I just could not get the no scopes to connect, boys. But lucky for me and for the sake of this video, other people were able to hit some shots with it so I could show you guys. And I actually ended up getting trick shotted with it. So you know what? I figured that was enough. I got embarrassed enough right there. So you know what? I said I'm gonna save myself the embarrassment for grinding with a shot for Blue Tiger, and I'm gonna move on. And wanna know what I moved on to, boys? I moved on to the replacement for Red Tiger, which yet again is another Cold War Zombies camo. This one's actually called Funkadelic. And I'm not gonna lie, this one goes absolutely crazy in my opinion. We got some blue in there, some red, yellow, orange, just all a bunch of just random lines all over a black background. And it actually looks fire on the intervention. So I'm gonna roll those now so you guys can see how the camo looks in game and make up your own mind whether you're gonna be rocking the Red Dagger replacement or not. Like vertically, because in this game, the ladders are so fucked up that if you're looking like vertical up or down, it makes you spin slower or something. Oh, so can you have this bounce? Dude, Serki, I can't even do that bouncing. You're just gonna flex on us and hit it real quick. Come on. How are you gonna do that? Oh, Nav hit, dude. The literal late bloomer. His third year on the scene. Okay. Oh, wait. He had distance? No way, Nav. Was that distance? It was, right? Oh, a little bit. A little bit. That was nice, though. And he's been it for a while, too. He's been it for like three weeks. Wait, B Hamp? Oh, not three weeks, like three months. Like, as long as I've known the dude. Oh, B Hamp. Was that the fucking zoom load reload knack? Oh, he didn't get the reverse after. But was that the zoom load reload knack, bro? Because that was really fire. With a burst load reload knack, I mean. Dude, we actually are close to another G Fuel giveaway as well. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, that was the worst shot I've ever hit. Dude, I failed the C line and I dragged the hard scope so hard. Look at this. I failed the C line and look how much I dragged that. I have no idea how that hit. That was literally the most random shot of my life. <laughs> that wasn't even supposed to hit. Yeah, those were all the shots we ended up hitting with Funkadelic. This one isn't my number one favorite in the pack. I think, like I said, that has to go to Urban and then probably number two, Arctic. But I'm pretty sure this is going to be a top three for me. But anyways, moving on from Red Tiger. Last but not least, we're finally done with the Zombies camos, boys. We're bringing it back over to multiplayer. And we're bringing it to the Fall camo replacement. In Cold War, this one is called Seducer. And it's kind of like a red wavy pattern with like different shades of red. It looks pretty cool in my opinion. Definitely not my favorite one. But hey, we still ended up hitting some shots with it. So without further ado, I'm going to roll those now. 125. Something like that. I need you to help me with that because I want to stream Warzone. But it's super laggy. I don't... Oh my god, I hit a shot and I didn't jump off, dude. Just my luck. Damn it. But yeah, I'll try to help you with that. Look at that, boys. <laughs> it was a 550 at that. That's actually like the first time that's happened to me on 4X, so I can't even be that mad about that. Ah. <laughs> uh, oh, never mind. Frenzy just hit real quick. I can't even make the class. Alright, what did Frenzy hit? Oh, righty tighty Nacta. Oh, wait. Wait, the righty tidy knack to the sentry, righty tidy knack out. Oh, Gooey just hit. Never mind. I'm gonna check this first. Did he finally hit? He said LOL. Damn, Gooey got them good beans. Oh, nice little steez, I guess. You will save forever. The strawberry shortcake and milk. I tried that one as well, and it just tasted like strawberry milk. It didn't taste like anything too special. Oh, I hit a little shot. I knew that was gonna hit too. Little lefty. I just got back from talking about my G Fuel and just hit a little lefty for the one time. Give me the points, boys. <laughs> They're my own points. But yeah, a little something something, Mishy. I couldn't have said it better myself, dude. I really couldn't have. And yeah, boys, those were all the shots we hit with the fall camo, aka Seducer. And with that being said, we've actually gone through all the Cold War camos. Like I said in the beginning of the video, the download link to all these camos is going to be in the description below, as well as a tutorial on how to install them into your game. I would have put a tutorial in this video as well, but as you guys can see, we hit so many shots, and I didn't want the video to be too long. But yeah, if you guys do end up downloading these camos and rocking them, make sure to tweet me any shots you hit with them at NECA. I'm going to be leaving it in the description below as well. I know Cold War isn't everyone's favorite card game as a matter of fact it's a lot of people's least favorite but i gotta say the camos in this game do look pretty nice so i want to see you guys do some bangers with them and yeah i think i've explained everything i need to about the cold war camos however if you guys do have any questions about the camo pack or how to use it or anything like that make sure to drop a comment in the comment section below and i'll do my best to answer you another way you can reach me like i said before is just tweeting at me i always see my mentions so if you have a question i'll make sure to hit you back and yeah like i said i'm pretty sure that's everything i got for today so without further ado let's roll the generic intro where i just promote everything i got and yeah that's gonna be a wrap in today's video thank you guys
guys so much for watching. And to anyone who's new to my channel, I hope you enjoy the video enough to consider subscribing with post notifications on. If you guys are wondering on how you can stay more connected or up to date with me, I'm going to be leaving all my links down below in the description. That's going to include my Twitter, which I'm active on so much daily, so make sure to go follow me over there if you don't yet. My Discord, my Twitch, my second channel, my TikTok. I'm active on all of them pretty regularly, so if you do enjoy my content and want to stay connected, please make sure to go check them out and show some love. Oh yeah, one last thing. Anyone who's new to my channel that might want to know more about me personally and not just like my clips, I will be doing a Q&A soon for you guys over on Twitter, so make sure to go follow me over there, like I said, if you haven't yet. But if you just have a quick question you want a quick answer to, I do try to read every single message in my Twitch chat and reply to it. So if you ever see me live, come stop by my chat, ask a question, and I'll answer it to the best of my abilities. But yeah, I'll catch you guys tomorrow with another banger upload. Peace out, everyone. Parallel neck out.